Hello and welcome to the Grumpy Eyes Rehabilitation Facility. Uh, so you guys know that I love this game, but um, I'm not gonna be playing much of it uh, until the next patch drops, because this update is the most fucking buggy update ever, and uh, it is game breaking <laughs> in every sense. Uh, I didn't really anticipate it, but I thought uh, like Crusader is gonna be game breaking. I thought that Orison is gonna have uh, shitty FPS and that it's gonna affect the whole fucking servers. But uh, no, good job, CAG. You actually managed to make it playable. Except the fact that I had to do fucking five character resets in the past 24 hours and uh, yeah I'm not gonna play much of it uh, I'm just gonna wait for the next patch and hope that they will fucking fix it so I'm gonna tell you what happened like the last three character resets so the first game breaking bug that I've uh, encountered and I wasn't the only one is the fact that you cannot claim some of your ships I couldn't claim my Andromeda I couldn't claim my um, Warlock, I couldn't claim my Eclipse, and a few more ships I, I, I already fucking forgot. So I did a character reset. Then I was doing a bunch of certs, and I got attacked by a player. Uh, he was red on my screen, and I got a crime stat by killing him. So I was trying to clear my crime stat on Korea, and uh, there was a guy. Uh, I was fucking. I was in the M50. He was in the Cuddy, and uh, I was about to kill him, but my shields were down, and I diverted all my power to shields, but nothing was happening. Like the shields weren't going up, so I ran away to figure what the fuck was happening with my shields. Uh, but no, the shields were still down. I toggled the power on the shields, still down. Then I toggled the power on my ship. As soon as I did it, I surrendered to no one because there was nobody close to me. And I was in Clusher. I had Crime Stat 4. So I was digging in Clusher for like an hour uh, while my friend was waiting for me to do our certs. And uh, after I dug my way out from Clusher, where I was put in for no fucking reason, just like due to a bug and due to the game not realizing that I'm not even close to the NPCs and that I didn't really surrender. Um, after that, I spawned on Everest inside the bed, like literally inside of it or under the bed, whatever. Like my character wasn't even fucking visible. So I tried uh, changing my gender, uh, didn't work, and then I did the character reset again. And I went to bed, because I'm not gonna wait for another fucking 15 minutes to play the game. Uh, I think I, actually it was like longer, because it was my <laughs> fifth character reset, but yeah, whatever. So today when I spawned, like after the character reset, after I fucking woke up, I didn't have a Moby Glass. Like, straight away, when I spawned. That happened to me twice in the PTU for like two weeks of playing. And it happened to me twice in the PU for like two days of playing. Uh, other than that, there's a bunch of other fucking ridiculous bugs. Uh, some of which are game breaking, some of which are just annoying. So I figured that I'm just gonna stop playing for a while until they patch it again. Until we get some new fucking annoying bugs that are not game breaking, at least. So just fucking bring us the cursor bug back, Jesus fucking Christ. I thought that the cursor bug was the worst bug ever, but I mean, at least it wasn't completely fucking game breaking. Because without a mobby glass, you can't do shit. You still spawn in the beds, like inside of them. For no fucking reason. Like, how long is that bug in the game? Jesus Christ. And like, I wasn't the only one that experienced all of these bugs. Everyone that I know had the same issue. 
Like people that have like one ship, they just couldn't claim it and they couldn't spawn it. And they were just stranded somewhere and couldn't do shit. So they were asking, the fuck are they supposed to do? Because they're new to the game. Welcome to Star Citizen, I guess, where you're just gonna roam on a station and do nothing because you can't spawn your ship. My friends had to do like three character resets or four, I'm not sure, on the first day of launch because he, he was trying to change the color of his Moby glass. And every time he fucking did it, it just fucking unequipped. Like, why does the Moby glass unequip? And it's not like we didn't report it. There's like a thousand fucking reports from the PTU. You can see them on the fucking issue console. Even I reported it. And of course, it got archived. Because like, no, we're just gonna fix the missing color on the arrow. Because like, there was a skin where like, there was just a missing color. And that was the priority, I guess. And like, when I said that this thing is gonna be fixed and they're working on it, did you play 3.14? It's fucking worse than the PTU. Like, the PTU was fucking getting better. Like, every day, there was a patch, and it was getting better and better. And I don't know what the fuck did they release in the live version, but that's not what I played in the fucking PTU, because this is dog shit. And yeah, I had like 20 fucking 30Ks in like two days of playing. I had like three 30Ks for two weeks of playing in the fucking PTU. So what, what the fuck is up with that? To be honest, it seems like they are using better fucking servers for the PTU because they are more stable than the shit that we have for the PU. PU servers is just fucking slow. Why is that? I mean, I guess they're not using like different servers, but it sure fucking seems like they are. Because like in the PTU, there was like 50 people and everybody was testing the fucking game. And there could be like 50 A90 jumps, or at one point I actually saw like four A90 jumps on all start trying to ram each other with like two 600 rise, just watching them. And the server was fucking fine. And the first fucking day of the PU, the server crashed like, I don't know, like 10 times. Eight to 10 times. Why? And once the Nine Tails event fucking started, I couldn't mine Hadonite. There was just no rocks spawning anywhere. I was on Daymar, I was on Aberdeen. Like, I spent two hours trying to find a Hadonite deposit, and I found like two of them, and they spawned inside of the big fucking rocks. Not the ones that you can actually mine, but the like placeholder ones. And of course, the scanning is still broken. And if you go mining with your prospector or your mole, the consumables just reset your mining laser back to scanning mode even though you're fucking mining already so yeah and the other youtubers because i guess i'm a youtuber now even though i'm a musician and uh yeah whatever the other youtubers are praising this patch like fucking i, I don't know like it's the second coming jesus fucking christ and i'm a fucking atheist like I don't know, guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna cut it shorter now. Uh, I'm probably not gonna be playing for some time. Uh, I'm gonna be doing some music. And once the patch becomes fucking playable again, I'm gonna try and um, do some montages for you guys. So keep subscribing and stay subscribed because I still love this game even though it's a buggy piece of shit that doesn't want to be played right now. And I don't want to be one of those YouTubers that just like plays other games and just uh, talks about Star Citizen for the views uh, and just reads the fucking patch notes. No, I actually want to play the game because I actually want to know what I'm talking about when I'm seeing it. Because, I mean, I want to bring you guys the truth. And... I'm not gonna be able to if I'm just reading the patch notes. So yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna attack the other YouTubers. I had already a whole fucking video about it. But once the new patch drops and once 
those fucking issues are resolved so once the game actually becomes playable i'm gonna do a few montages for you guys uh with my music and uh i hope you like them i really don't know what i'm gonna do i have one montage uh that i'm preparing uh for my organization yeah i should probably plug it now <laughs> it's called uh, the overlords and uh, we are a mercenary bounty hunter uh, organization and uh we only accept good, good people and i guess you guys are good people uh so there's gonna be a link down below in the info section uh it's a discord link and the um uh, organization link on the fucking other side website where you can um, apply and uh yeah after that i'm gonna do a few more montages and if the patch is actually playable i'm gonna do well i'm gonna continue with the channel i guess uh maybe i'll post gameplay from other games like post uh, scriptum or uh squad i'm not sure we'll see but uh you might just hit the bell button because uh i'm not gonna be posting much uh in the next week you it's, uh, you can consider it as a fucking vacation whatever so i guess you should hit the uh, bell button uh because you'll be notified when i upload again yeah make sure to subscribe if you didn't already uh and that's it for today and uh for a while uh i'll see you when i see you i guess uh don't forget to bring a towel when you're traveling through space and my name is grumpy eye and da -da 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 -da, subscribe and hit the bell button because you'll be notified when i upload again because i'm taking a break from this shitty buggy piece of mess that we call star citizen yeah <laughs> all right guys see ya